guys welcome or welcome back to my channel today's video is going to be a little bit of an old school one a little bit of a nostalgic one meaning these videos have been on youtube for quite a number of years i remember before i started making my own videos i used to sit for hours and watch what people have in their bags or their purses so i thought you know what why not i just started my channel i've always wanted to do one so yeah this is my what's in my bag so without further ado let's get into it but before we get into the video you know what i'm gonna say please make sure that you subscribe like comment share the videos and yeah hit that bell notification so that you can also get notified when i post my next video so this baby right here is my daily driver um i love this little bag i've been looking for a tote for quite some time now and the ones that i've seen before i didn't really like them i didn't really think that they were cute and if you've noticed from my previous videos, I do love Coach, I love their bags, I love their purses. So when I seen this one, I just had to get it. Let me just show you again. Isn't it so cute? And it has a little hedgehogs on it. All right, this is what I use and you will probably be seeing this bag a ton. I'm just saying. <laughs> But let's get into what's in there. So the first thing that I have here is my phone case, which is representative of my phone, but I'm filming with my phone right now. So this is my phone case. I think it's really cute. I love the charm um, and I love the color. Baby blue is also one of my favorite colors. So, yeah. so the next thing that I have in my bag are obviously my keys and I have my car keys on there. Um, what else do I have on here? My garage opener the little i don't even know what these things are called but it's to open um the door in the lobby and i also have my house key a key to my mom's house and my mailbox key and i also have hand sanitizer because listen i'm not going anywhere without hand sanitizer and i typically have in my bag in my car i would probably have like two in my bag one in my keychain sorry one in my bag one on my keychain, one in my car. Can't go anywhere without hand sanitizer. And I love these little ones from Bath and Body Works. This one is in the scent, Tis the Season. What does it smell like? It smells kind of citrusy, which is, I wouldn't peg citrusy to be a part of Tis the Season. But anyways, these are my keys. The next little thing that I have in here is this little bad boy. It is a tiny ring light for your phone. And I did talk about this in my previous video, my November favorites, which I'll leave a link somewhere along here. If you're a content creator or if you just like taking nice pictures and you need that extra voom, -va that extra light, then I would highly suggest this little baby right here. I got this at HomeSense. This is Canada's equivalent to home goods. I believe that's what it's called <laughs> but i paid like nine dollars for it but you can get it on amazon they have different prices different styles and let me see if it's charged so this is the first setting second setting and the third setting and this is what it would look like i'm using a bigger ring light right now but i feel like this you can still see the difference that it'll make um yeah i walk with this like let's say it's date night or we're going out during the night time and i want to take selfies then i have this little thing with me the next thing that i have are my airpods i think this is the first generation don't quote me on that i don't know what gen this is but i've had it for about three four years now i do feel like one of them is dying like literally dying so i do need to get me a new pair of airpods they're just so expensive and i'm like i got these ones for free actually i've gotten a phone a couple of years ago and they had like a boxing day deal and i ended up getting these ones for free the next thing that i have is this little notebook all of my secret formulas are in here <laughs> i'm joking um but no i write everything so i feel like and let me know if i'm the only person like that i feel like we've been texting for so long that sometimes i forget how to write and I don't like that because I like writing. I love pretty stationery. I mean, this is not really pretty, but this is what I have right now. I am thinking of going to Indigo or Chapters and getting a cuter one for the new year. But in the meantime, I got this from my mom, I think. Yeah, it, it has like some logo on there, but I write everything in here, my ideas, my thoughts, um, reminders, 
and yes i know I, I do have these things on my phone as well but i just like having a physical copy and i just like putting pen to paper so yeah let me know if i'm the only one in this tech driven era that likes to write stuff down the next thing that i have here it is my wallet and again i spoke about this in my monthly favorites it comes with a very long strap so i did mention in my previous video that sometimes if i don't want to take my bag with me i would just take this because i can put it across me like a crossbody and it has all my cards in here and i can typically fit a little lip balm in there hand sanitizer again it's on my key so i don't really need to put it in here but this right here I love it. I, I cannot say enough good things about it. And I will have it linked down below if you would like to purchase this yourself. The next thing that I have, it's in this pocket right here, and it is two masks. So I have a disposable one and then I have one of those cloth ones. I still wear my mask. Now granted, there are some places that I go and I don't wear it, but now that it's now cold flu season and it is still COVID season, I still wear it, especially in the malls or any place for that matter that's really crowded. I don't trust it. And people are out here just coughing without covering their mouths or wearing a mask. So I'm like, okay, cool. You don't want to wear the mask, but if you're going to be coughing in a public setting, please cover your mouth, please. It's not that hard to just do this or to just do this. It's really not that hard. But yeah, I always have masks on me. Again, I typically have a box of disposable ones in my bag, sorry, in my car. I like the black ones. I don't like those white duck looking ones. Those I think look really ugly, but I do like the black ones. So I typically have a box of that in my car. And the other thing that I have in this pocket here are two pens. How cute is this pen? So when I got engaged, I had signed up for a bridal subscription box and this and another rose gold one came in there. So I always have pens on me, typically two, because if one doesn't write, then I have a backup. The last thing that I have is this pouch right here. And it's nothing special, but I had a, a set um, in this and I thought, oh, this little thing is so cute because let me know, ladies. Sometimes we just take stuff and we put it in our bags, and digging through our bags, looking for the thing that we're looking for. We can't find it because there's so much shit under there. So I thought, why not put like the smaller items, little case thingy, and then put it in my bag. So I will share with you what I carry with me in this case or what's currently in it. So my little case is open. And the first thing that we have here, tissue. I always gotta have tissue on me. Again, I keep some in my car, but I always like to have some on hand um one for like opening doors two for like dabbing my face three for i don't know wiping utensils if we go to a restaurant or if we go to a fast food store i don't know if they're washing these things clean the utensils like the forks and the knives and all that so i like to wipe my stuff that's just me the next thing that i have in here and again i spoke about this in my previous video so this is a vaseline jelly stick and like I explained in my last video, now, you know, we're hand sanitizing more, we're washing more, at least I hope y'all are doing that. My hands get really dry, especially in the colder months. So I like to have this where I would just rub it along my hands or rub it in between my fingers and on my um, cuticles, because those are the places that get really dry the most. So I always have that with me. I don't get like gunk stuck in my rings. The next thing that I have here, how cute is this it is a little deodorant and it's by native it is in the scent coconut and vanilla i use natural deodorants and if you use natural deodorants you know that sometimes they don't last long and i'm not trying to be out here smelling funky so i walk with a tiny one i use native and green beaver that's the other company but the one that i'm currently using right now is the boom boom Boom, Sol de Janeiro, let me just say that because people probably don't know what Boom Boom is. So Sol de Janeiro, they also have a natural deodorant, but it's also in the scent as the Boom Boom cream. So it smells absolutely divine. So the next two things that I want to talk about are lip glosses. I love me a shiny lip. I love it. I love it. I love it. I don't know how else to say that I love it. Um, and the two that I have with me here. Now, before I get into that, let me just say, I love me a high-end lip gloss and typically my high-end lip gloss is from Fenty Beauty. I probably have like eight of them. And then I also love me on the cheaper side, the ones from Bath & Body Works. These ones, they give you a shine of gloss like no freaking other. 
So this is the one from Bath and Body Works. It is in the scent Strawberry Pound Cake and they also taste good. The next one that I have here is from Fenty Beauty. It is in the scent or the flavor Baby Brute. So this is what it looks like. So the next thing that I have in here are perfumes, mini perfumes. So these are the scents that I'm liking right now. This one is Versace. <laughs> this is Versace Bright Crystal. How cute is this little bottle? And then these two, they're by MFK. So one, it is Gentle Fluidity. Love the freaking scent of that and I need to get me the big bottle. And then the other one, it's Le Ale Rose. I hope I pronounced that correctly. This is more so a spring summer scent. Gentle fluidity, I feel like you can wear both in like the colder months and the warmer months. So perfume ladies, perfume. Oh, I do also have another one here and this one is by Chloe and it is called, it's so hard to read this, Nomade, Nomad, whatever, however you pronounce it, but this smells, it smells so freaking good. Again, all these little things, I need to get me the big bottle. So I typically like buying the smaller bottles like this because they come in different um, different scents and different brands. So I like to test them out that way so I know what I like, what I don't like, and then I can proceed to buy the bigger bottles. The last couple of things that I have here, lotion. You cannot go wrong with lotion. So I have this Nivea cream i really love this it, it's right up there with the vaseline stick it moisturizes your hands really well this works really well for the dry season or the drier months the colder the colder months and then i have these little ones by bath and body freaking love bath and body works hand lotion because they all smell so freaking good that sometimes i just want to lick my hands because it smells so good but don't do that don't lick your hands this one is in the scent pink pineapple sunrise so i typically buy a couple of these and have them on hand and the last thing that i have here sunscreen do not skip out on sunscreen this is the hawaiian tropic it is sheer so it's oil free it's spf 30 it says here it protects softens leaves skin radiant which it does because i do get the bigger bottle of this sometimes just to put all over my entire body especially in the summertime this one i walk with it and what i've started doing is when i go to the nail salon i typically get like gel manicures that uv light is not good for our skin so i would put some sunscreen on my hands before i put it in there and another thing that I like to do is put it on my hands when I'm driving because sometimes the sun hits just your hands on the steering wheel and I'm not trying to be looking crinkly and wrinkly. So, hey, gotta have sunscreen. And most importantly, please, when you're putting sunscreen on your face, do not forget your neck. Don't forget your neck, please. So face, neck, your hands, entire body, go wild with the sunscreen. So last but not least, these two things are always with me. So this is glasses cleaner or lens cleaner. So I wear glasses. This is lens cleaner. I always have this on me. So when I got my, when you get your glasses, they give you lens cleaner. So I use this for my glasses and I also use it to clean the lens of my camera and a microfiber cloth. This may seem extra, but hey, I need my pictures to come out very clear and I need my glasses lens to be clear. So these two are always with me. So I'm just going to show you the bag empty. Again, this is what it looks like. It has the short straps. It also has like the longer strap. If your hands get tired of just holding it like this, this is what it looks like on the inside. So it has a pocket right here, and then it has another one right here. This is the back, and then it has these little gold detailing at the bottom, which I really like gold, so I had to have this. And brown, this type of brown is a pretty neutral color, so it goes with any and everything. So yeah, I will have the bag linked down below if you would like a little hedgehog coach bag. All right, guys, this is the end of my video. This is everything that I currently have in my bag. Let me know what other videos you would like to see from me. Leave it down in the comments. As always, thank you so much for watching, for liking, for subscribing. It truly means the world to me. I truly appreciate it. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.
Thank you.